Hello everyone, Rich here, back for part 2 of this HMY Britannia tutorial. Uh, today's focus will be the ship superstructure, which will be the white section over there on the prototype. You can see it'll be about one, two, two and a bit decks, I think, uh, for the superstructure, and also a couple of deck houses on the top. Uh, so that'll be the focus for today. Uh, so what we're going to do first, I'm just going to point out first that uh, in part 1 we added the deck. And what I've done now, I've added centre blocks to each section of the raised decks. So if you look down here, you've got each end, each end of the raised deck. So this first section here, I've added a red block in the middle. The next section down, another centre block. Next section, centre block, and then the next section, a centre block as well. So just to mark out the centre point of each raised section. So that's what I've added there. So what we're going to do first is add the first section of the front of the superstructure. So we we'll go down to the last raised deck section, which is this one here, and go behind the centre block. So like I say, this is the basically down to the main deck level, so the flat section. Go behind that, and what we'll do is add a red centre block again, and then we're going to build a wall which is 13 wide, so that is uh, 6 other sides, so 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 that way, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 that way, so it's 13 wide like that. And then we want 5 out, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and then two, and then two, and then back two, one, two, and then back four. And I'll just make sure this works out right, because it does look a bit odd. So it's 13, five, two, two. Sorry about my delay then, I had to think for a second. And then to the sides, on the side of the deck, we'll go, on the side of the ship, rather, go four, one, two, three, four, like that. So it does look a bit odd, but we'll do, we'll do the same on the other side. Sorry for my pause, but my brain went, <laughs> brain went to funny. Uh, so we'll do the same on the other side, go out five, one, two, three, four, five, and then it's two, two, back two, and then back four. One, two, three, four, on the side like that. It looks a bit odd at the moment, but when it's all laid, uh, built up right, it should be all fine. So what we want to do now is increase all of these. If we go from the front, so front wall here, increase all of that uh, to four high. Actually, is it four high? Five high? Uh, make, it, make it five high, so two, three, four, five, like that. Make it five high all the way around or basically the same height as this wall here. So if we build this five high, just build all the walls, the white walls around to that same height. So I should just do the front wall first. And I just do one side as well. I do the front wall like this. Like so, then I do the sides. I do one side. So the row of five there. Build it all to five high like so. There we go, so that's the front wall done. That's half of it done anyway, so it should look something like that. I will just go and double check. Um, but like I'm saying, the front wall, five high. When it gets to the side on the black, it's only four high, but it's the same height again, because remember the black is one block higher than the deck. So I just go back to the prototype and make sure i got this right, because if I screw this up again, which I've done twice already, I'm going to end up shooting myself. But on the front, yeah, it's fine. So the side wall there is four high, and the rest is five high, so that's fine. Hunky diddly dories, that's fine, done, deadly damn, and wonderful like that. So that's one side done, so like I said, I'll just do the other side as well, build that to the same height. Oh, damn it. And there we go, so there's the front wall done like that, that's the front curve done. Right, so what we're going to do now is, on the inside, uh, working on either side, so to say both sides, if we go on the inside of the side wall here, which is the on the outside edge of the ship, go one forward of the end, so here's the end here, go one forward to this point here, and we're going to build our inside walls uh, four, so one, two, three, four in like that, and then increase that to three high, I think. Just trying to work out, is it three high? Yeah, three high for the minute, so build that three high. Like that, and then the sides, we're going to build down the side. If we do the same on the other side quickly, so build that in four as well. So one, two, three, four, and build that three high. And then for the sides, we're going to want six, six back, so one, two, three, four, five, six, and then eleven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. And then 10, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 
Oh no, it's not 10, it's 101, sorry. <laughs> so I apologise for that one. So it's not 10, it's 101. So put the first block there. And then build 101. So remove the 10 and replace it with 101. Okay, I apologise for that. So 101 is what we want. <laughs> apologies for that one. So 101 is what we want. How far is that? That's... That's 103, so that's too, too far, and there we are, that's, that's 101 like that, there we are, so it's 100, 101 like that. And then at the end of the 101, you want to curve back inwards again, so it's going to be 13, so 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, and then 8, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, and then 9, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and then 2, 1, 2, and then inward six, one, two, three, four, five, six, and then a colour block to mark the centre like so. So hopefully <laughs> that's all worked out right. Just do the same the other side quickly. So at the end of the f on the end of the four in, I mean, what was it? It was six back, so one, two, three, four, five, six, and then eleven, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, and then a hundred and one. So first block and then 100 after that, so 101 in total how far is that? that's 94 and that is 102, one more removed and that's 101, that's fine, so 101 done there and then Curving inwards again, what's 13? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. And 8, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. And then 9, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. And then 2, 1, 2. Inward 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. And there we go, that's all lined up. And there we go. So that is that section all done like that. Now I'm just going to do a quick jump cut while I work out what to do. I was, I was going to say build these walls up, but we don't need to do them just yet because I need to work out which sec uh, how many we need to build up first. Because um, if we go back to the prototype, uh, the height of the walls changes as we go back. So if we just look where the crosshairs are just there, the ship, the height of the superstructure does change in height. So you can see it goes from three blocks high to four blocks high. So I just need to work out which ones uh, we need to go back on. So. The, f the sign of the 101, I need to work out, goes to 90, so 90, yeah, I'll just work this one out. So, what we'll do, we'll build the first sections up, so the, so the row of 6 and 13, we'll build them, is it 6 and 13? No, 6 and 11, sorry. 6 and 11, build them to 3 high, like so. So those sections there are three high, and then on the 101, you've got a, a line here of 101. Basically, what you want to do is increase that to three high all the way along, like so, three high like this. So about three high like so, I'll do this as quick as I can like that. And then once you've done the, th the three high, the first 90 blocks leave that three high, and then the last 11 blocks increase to four high. So when we get to that in just a second, I'll just build as quick as I can. There we go, so that's the three high like that. And like I said, the side wall here, which is 101, the first 90 blocks you leave as as three high but the last 11 it increased to four high so one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven you leave the, you know, increase them to four high so yeah the last 11 four high and then the rest around the back increase to four high as well so i shall do that as well with the free hand i go only go as far as the center then i do the other side off camera So I was going to do a jump cut, but then I thought, nah, I'll do it all on camera, work it out my way. So just do the round to the side. And 
and there we go. So that's one side done. As you can see, the first 90 are three blocks high, the rest are four blocks high. So that's what you want to do on both sides. So I've done one side already, and it don't look too bad. I say it don't look too bad. It's not great, it's not brilliant, but it will do. Um, and I'll leave it at that. So that's one side done. What I'll do now, I'll do a quick jump cut while I do the other side, which is this side here. And then we can move on. So um, hopefully that's okay. So uh, back in a moment. Okay, back again. So there's both sides of the superstructure done so far. And it should look something like that. So before I move on to building any more, what we'll do is start adding the doors and windows. Now this is sort of a, a normal... Well, it's slightly different to what I normally do. Normally I just put a pair of doors and shitloads of windows, but what I'm going to do this time, slightly different, I put a pair of doors on the end wall here first in that little cubby hole there. And then what I do on the prototype, I did windows in pairs. So I put a pair of windows, like so, like that. And then I leave a three block gap between each. And we added one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Nine. Well, it depends how you want to do this, really. We can add about five to ten pairs if you want to so leave a three block gap between each pair so one two three and then add another pair three block gap add another pair and it kind of guess goes like this so as long as you've got three got three block gap between each pair like that's so how many pairs of that that's one two three hang on, one two three four five that's five pairs six pairs Seven and then uh, eight pairs. So there's eight pairs of windows, and then we'll put a pair of doors after that. And then again, do the same again. So one pair, two pairs, three pairs, four pairs, five, six. Seven and then eight pairs again, and then after that, just add the pair of doors again. So it's just carrying on the same design. It's oh shit, made a hole. So yeah, it's just a, it's, 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 it's more accurate to the real ship because that sort of thing does does look much better. You, know, you can't see it very well from this angle. If you look at the prototype in the distance, you can sort of get a better idea. But just carry on down the side. I do one side, then I'll do a jump. Well, not a jump cut, but I do the other side later on. Just get a rough idea of this design out of the way. So I just put the pairs and windows in. That's one pair, and then two pairs, three pair, three pairs, four pairs, five pairs, six pairs. And then seven pairs. I put seven pairs this time, and then I'll put another pair of doors at the end. Like so. And then around the back. The back wall we can leave blank for now, because there will be a set of stairs going on there, so don't worry too much about that. But there's one side of the windows done. Like I say, you can't see very well, because of the bloody colour of everything, but... It's it's all relatively good. So that's 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 one side of the windows done. Like I said, I'll do the other side later on during a jump cut, but uh, that's the windows laid out. So what we're going to do now is start with the overhang of the side, and what we're going to do is go down to the side of the front wall, so the front wall here, which is the side wall here. Go to the second block down on the top, so the top block there. Go to the second one down, which is this block here. And we're going to build back a row of three, so back one, two, three, like that. And then we want uh, eleven, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. So it's out to the side. And then we want 96, that's 96, so put the first block there to measure it, and then we want 96, so put it all the way down the side, 96 all the way down the side of the ship. How many is that? That is 92, 93, 94, 95, 96, like that, so it's 96 there. And then what we're going to do now is, the last five blocks, we're going to add a row of thir a, a row of 14, but overlapping the first five, the last five blocks. So we count 14. So one, two, three, four, five. So it's five blocks like that, overlapping the end like that. So it's five blocks there, and then make that to 14. So it's five going forward, and then 14, or we'll make it 14. So it'll be 11 back. So it's five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. So say so it's a row of 14, the first five overlapping the last five. 
of the deck below. So it's a lower line of 14 like that. And then we want a line of 13. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. And then 8. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. And then 4. 1, 2, 3, 4. 3. 1, 2, 3. And then 2. 1, 2. And then in 3. 1, 2, 3. And then inward 7. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. And a colour block to mark the centre like that. And there we go. That's one side done. And it should look something like that. Now the reason you got this overhang like so is because the deck rises. You can just see inside on the inside wall there where the deck where the uh, the inside walls change in height. This up here will change in height as well because the deck does rise by one block. You can just see it on the prototype over there. If I just fly over to it, the uh, the stern does change in height back here. So you can just see back here. Got a set of stair blocks there to mark where the deck rises. So that's what's that section is all about. So yeah. So just quickly fly back to the back end of the ship and review what we've done. And that looks all fine. So I just did the other side as well. I will, like I said, I will do the doors and windows as well, but uh, or later on. But all's good. So second block down on the side, we go back three, one, two, three, and then uh, eleven, one, ooh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, and then uh, ninety-six. So one, and then. We'll measure from there to so 96. And that is 59, so a bit further. That's 87, 88, 89, 90, 91, 92, 92, 93, 94, 95, 96. There we go, 96. And then the, f the last five increased to. The last five overlap by five of the fourteen, so I want fourteen overlapping the last five, so go five forward. One, two, three, four, five. And then increase that to fourteen, so five, make it six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. Like that, so it's overlapping. And then we want thirteen. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. And then eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And then four, one, two, three, four, and then three, one, two, three, and then two, one, two, and then three in, one, two, three, and then seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. There we go. And that's our deck house sort of done. What well, deck sort of done. Um and it don't look too bad. Yeah, so that's that little job done there. So what we're gonna do now is to go to the front of said superstructure and to add the deck itself. The deck's going to be a complicated one. Well, not really complicated, it's just a bit awkward. Go to the front wall of the superstructure on the inside here and go to the second block down. And for now, we're just going to add a line for the deck right now. So the deck, like I said, is one block down and it's going to be 100, 113 blocks. That's 113 blocks long. So I just build a line, centre line for the minute. So we want 113. So I just build that freehand. So there's one block down from the top, so you can just see the deck is the height of the outside line and higher than the inside wall. So the deck, when it's filled in, will sit on top of those inside walls. But we just want a line of 113 for the minute. And I found that, that's 112, and then 113, like that. So 113, like so, and then behind that 113, we want to go back one block higher and just go all the way to the back. So it's one one three and then on top of that add a line. I don't know how long this line is but just build it all the way to the back. To the back of the ship like so up to that centre line there you go. So there's our deck added there. You can see it's one block higher at the back. And then we want to do is at the end of the one one three just build that out to the side. Like so and then the same with the one above, just build that out. Maybe one block too far forward. Right, actually, it's fine. It's fine. So yeah, just build it out to the side like that, and then do the same on the other side. Just build it out. Like so. And then where the deck goes down, and actually just start filling in the deck here as well. So, so 
we go all the way to the side. And then in this groove here, you add the stair blocks. So I'm going to have stairs. I'll just add the stairs, stair blocks in there like that. Don't need to add these right now, of course, though, because we, we put the deck houses in first, but we just fill the decks in first. So there we go. So there's the first few phases of the deck done. So just fill the rest in. Going all the way forward at this height, and then the one behind it at that height goes all the way back. So, I'll say it's all relatively uncomplicated. So, there we go. So there's the first few phases of the deck done. So, what you want to do is just fill the whole rest of the decks in this deck at this height, that deck at that height, and everything should be fine. So, I shall do a jump cut while I sort that out, and I shall return in just a moment. Okay, back again. So what we're going to do now is to add a little bit of detail to this thing. Um, what we're going to do is add a curve and pillars to the side walls now. Um, go back down to where the overhang of the upper deck is. And then this little section here. We'll just add, we're going to just add a court stair. Which is this thing. Add a court stair in there like that. Just to create the curve of the uh, overhang like that. And then what we're going to do now is using fence posts, which I... I normally use court, uh, end rods, but I'm going to use birch fences for this one. Um, every nine blocks along the side here, underneath, we're going to add a pillar. So for the top block of the overhang, we'll go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And then we add a pillar down, a pillar down like that. So every nine blocks, add a pillar. So just do this all the way, all the way along the side. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Pillar one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Pillar. Don't know how many there are in total, but not many. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Pillar one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Pillar one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Pillar one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Pillar one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Pillar, you get the idea where this is going. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Pillar. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Pillar. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Pillar. And then you get, pillars are going to be a bit longer when you get a bit further back. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Pillar. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Pillar, which are now three blocks high. And a bit further, one more I think. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Pillar. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I think that'll be the last one there. And there we go. So that's our pillars added on one side like that. Yeah, it looks a bit odd, but uh, it'll do. So that's one side done. I'll do the other side later on because I just want to get this design out the way like that. So that's our pillars and a little bit of curving detail done there and then one more job to do before we move on is to add the stairs to the back end so I did say this back wall here we'll leave that blank because there's going to be some stairs so what we'll do for the center block we'll remove remove that center block and we'll build two blocks of wood back so one two like that and then uh, one blo one wood block to the right so we're looking forward okay so one block to the right and then stairs down sideways so one two three four five down like that and just on one side so you don't need to do the other side just on one side and then we'll add some supports underneath and then the banisters the banisters are two up two up two up two up and then around the wood like that and there we go there's our stairs added like so like I say you can if you want to put them both sides but as this ship is just one sided stair so we'll just leave them one sided like that and it don't look too bad and then if you want to, behind the stairs you can add some windows and doors. If we did the doors and windows down the side, we'll just add some windows. A pair of windows there like that, and then maybe um, another pair of windows. Or so. I don't know, it depends what you want to do here. You can put a pair of doors or a pair of windows, as up to you, but that's what I've done there. And there we go, so that's our design there. And as that's the centre block we just added, so I'll put the centre block back there. That's only for me to work out as the centre, so I'll put that back there. And uh, there we go, so that's that little job done there. So like I said, I'll do the pillars on the other side later on, but just want to get this design out the way first. So all we're going to do now is move on to the next deck house. And we'll just focus on the first deck house, because there's to be two 
major deck houses on the top deck. So the first deck house, deck house A, and then deck house B will be the bigger one at the back. So I'll just focus on the first one, A, for the minute. So we go to the front wall of the superstructure we just built on the front of the deck. And on the wood, um, we shall go to the third, uh, fourth block back on the wood. So one, two, three, four, and add a center block like so. And then you're going to build this wall 19 wide. So that is uh, 9 either side. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9 that way. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9 that way. And then behind the 9 or behind the 18, you want uh, 3 out. 1, 2, 3. And then 2. 1, 2. And then 2 back. And so forth. Is it? Hang on. So it's 2. So 3, 2. And then 2 back. And then one, so it's kind of confusing how this goes, but I'm trying to work it out actually. Uh, 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 I think that's about right. So just count that last block there as it. So we just do the same on the other side. It looks a bit confusing, but we'll go with it. So same on the other side, three, one, two, three, and two, and then back two, and then count this as the one there like that. So there we are. So that should be the design like that. Now what you want to do. Is increase that to five high. So we'll start at the end. So we'll go from the ends on the sides. Just go this add one block here. Go build that to five high. So one, two, three, four, five like that. And then the row of three there. Five high like that. And then the two on the inside. Just trying to dif just trying to differentiate from the outside to the inside. If you see what I mean. So the outside you'll have a row of three, three, two, and also like that. And then the rest. Build that to five high, like so. Build it all the way across. Ignoring the blocks that I'm adding by mistake. And there we go, that sort of looks a bit better. Do the same on the other side. Add the three, one, two, three, the two, two back, and then the one. Build that to five high. And there we go. That is the front of our superstructure done for the minute. And then go back on the inside. Uh, so from the row of one, which is this section, so the last section here, which is this part here, if we go on the inside of that, we're going to build the inside walls. Uh, just trying to work out how to do this. I'm going to build in three, I think. So from the inside of this point, go in three. One, two, three, like that. And I'm just going to go to the just go to the prototype here because I'm a bit confused myself. Because I'm not very good at this. Uh, so it's can't get in there actually. So there's the two there, and just add one, two, three. Yeah, building add th add three if I can get out. Anyway. Like I said, I just add the three, and we'll just build it one high for the minute. So build it build in three. So same on the other side from the row of two here, going one, two, three like that. That's right. And then, uh, trying to work this one out, uh, inner walls, build in four, and then we want to build back 23, so back 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23. And then, I'm just trying to work out which way it goes, it out 3 or in 3? Uh, oh, it's, it, is it in 3? Yeah, in 3, I think. I want to double check this, because I know I'm going to screw this up. So... Yeah, it's in three. Let's make sure. Yeah, it's in three. <laughs> so you build the line of 23, and then you want a line of three. So 23, and then three. One, two, three, like that. So you're curving inward slightly, and then 10. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Plus two, one, two. And then two in, one, two. And then in four. One, two, three, four. Plus a centre block like that. So there we are, that's that bit done there. Do the same on the other side, so from the row of 3, build 23 back. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 20, 21, 22, 23. And then in 1, 3, 1, 2, 3, and then 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Um, and then the 2, 1, 2, in 2, 1, 2, and then 4. 1, 2, 3, 4, like that. And there we go. This deck house A laid out. And it should look something like that, right? What we'll do now 
is before we increase the heights of those walls that we're going to build the overhang to the side. So if we go to the top two blocks, so these top two blocks here, um, I'll start from the bottom one and then increase it in a minute. So from the second one down, we want to build back three, one, two, three, like that. So we're going to build sort of like we did on the bottom down here, just build an overhang. So it's back three, and then seven, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And then curving in, we want two, one, two, uh, two again, one, two, and then three, one, two, three, and then in two, one, two, and then down, bonk, bonk, to the foundation below. So that's one side like that and then do the same the other side actually do the top row as well so build that three seven two two three and then two in like that so when we add the deck the deck will sit inside like that so do the same the other side so from the second one down back three one two three and then seven one two three four five six seven and curving in which we want two two three one two three and then two in one two down two like that and then increase that to three high uh, two high like so and there we are that's that bit done there and then the bit between the section between the pillar and the front wall this part of the wall here increase that to three high like so do the same the other side like that don't look too bad do it and then the rest of the walls behind around the back increase to five, uh, four high so two three four high all the way around so four high rather than five because the five is just for the front half increase it to four high all the way around So just do the one half of the minute. So there's half of it done. And it should look something like that. It looks a bit odd at the moment, but it'll do for the minute. So what I'm gonna do now, I'll do a quick no, actually I won't do a quick jump cut because I want to do the want to do the deck as well, because the deck is slightly different. So I just quickly do the other side as well. <laughs> there's me thinking ahead and not thinking ahead far enough. So just quickly do this. So this all four four high like so. So there's our deck done like that or deck house rather and what we want to do now is add the deck and the deck's going to be in two colors so what we want to do is the front half of the deck house will be wood deck and up to where the the sides reattach to the deck house in here uh, the rest of it will be gray so we just go wood wood up to this point here so put add the wood deck up to this point like so up to where the uh, side fins all the side flanges reattached so the rest of the deck forward of this point would be all wood so I just start filling that all in with wood like so so that'll all be wood like that so I just stand here and use the fill tool the fill tool quickly so just do fill wood by 200 and that fills all that in like so so that's the front half done like that and then the rest of it at the back will all be grey so I shall stand on this block here and the rest of it will all be grey so I should just use the fill 251 uh, 7 by 200 and that fills the rest in with grey and that's how it should look like that marvellous so that's like I say that's the um, that deck house done there. that's deck house A and then deck house B will follow in a minute so um, they don't look too bad for the minute and uh, there, looks right. So what I'm going to do, I should do a quick jump cut while I work out what to do next. And then uh, I shall add the pillars and things on the other side and then we shall move on. The windows and doors on this section here are slightly different as well. I will go through that in a minute, but uh, just focus on the main part. So uh, back in a moment. Okay, back again. So we're going to move on now and do a little bit more detail before I add the next deck house. Uh, this is going to be just basic uh, windows and doors and things. Now I will point out on the prototype I did use black glass for the windows but on the on the one I'm doing here I've, I've mainly used 
uh, clear glass so you can change that up if you want to um, it's not a huge change but from now on I just use the black glass because it's more better looking uh, from the front wall here front wall on the bottom front wall on the top we're gonna add some windows and doors we're gonna have some doors on the bottom first so on the side walls here which are these five ones here just add a pair of doors here like so do the same on the other side a pair of doors on a section there like that and then across the front uh, I think one block up from the bottom we just add sort of four windows two either side of the center like that so you've got your four windows there and then on the next deck up on the front one we'll just add four windows again single blocks like so these ones are a bit more spaced out so four uh, window there and a window there there we go so you've got your four windows eight windows in total across the front like that and then for the rest of the deck house on the side this deck house we just built it's just basically going to be single windows so if we put a pair of doors in here first um, could put them in this section here yeah put the doors in the in the end like that like we did on the previous deck and then the rest of the ray rest of the way around just put single windows roughly every fourth block or so it's not accurate to the real ship but you know things have to yeah you've got to sacrifice things here and there but there you go so what we'll do there we'll put an extra pair of doors on the end just to make it even like that so you got doors or windows all the way down the side like that so I'll just do the same the other side put some door on the inside like this and then we'll put a window every fourth block like this down the side sorry I'm talking like you oh, but that's how it is uh, am I doing? oh yeah windows da -da -da -da. Da -da 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 -da. window there, window there and then a pair of doors at the end marvellous, 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 beautiful there we go, so that's that little job done there um, so what we're going to do now is add the next deck house. Now this deck house is like the deck itself we're building on. It's awkward because there's going to be a raised, a raisedness in it. So we go here. We go to the back wall of the said deck house previous, and leave a one block gap, and then put another center block there like that. So you've got a single block gap like that, um, and then the deck house front wall we're going to build now is 13 wide. So that is what's that? That's six other sides. So one, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six, like that. There we are. There's our front wall, like that. And then from the 13, we want to add two out to the side, like that. And like that. So it's like that. And then the, <laughs> the sides, we want five back. So one, two, three, four, five. And then out two. One, two, like that. And then the sides again, we want 22. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22. And then 2, 1, 2, like that. I think, it's, is it out or is it in? It's out. Okay, so it's 2 like that. And then we want 43. Now, when we build this line of 43, it will go up 1 because of the height of the deck. So we just want a line of 43. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43. So I just measure that. So that's 5 plus 38. There we go. It's 43. That's fine. So there's our 43. And then from the end of that, you want to build in 3. So build in 1, 2, 3. Like that. And then back 3. 1, 2, 3. And then 2. 1, 2. And then inwards three, one, two, three, and then inwards four, one, two, three, four, and then a marker to mark the center block like so. And I think that is just on the center. I'll just make sure it is. Yep, that's fine. So that is on the center. All these center blocks will line up, so that's that's what makes it good. So that's one half done. I just quickly do the other half, or the other side rather. So it's what was it? it was back five, one that so back one, two, three, four, five, out two, and then twenty two. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, and then 2, and then 43, so I'll, so I want 38 first. I'll, I'll build this uh, freehand, so I want 38, so it's basically 38 up to the, up to the where the deck rises, so it's 38 up to there, and then 5, so 39, 40, 41, 22, 43, and then in 2, 1, 2, and back three, one, two, three, and two, and then in three, one, two, three, and in four, one, two, three, four. I've screwed up, and I hang on. So it's forty-three, 
in three and then back three back two and then in have I screwed up? how is this possible? Um. Hmm. let me just quickly do a jump cut while I sort this one out my mistake because I didn't go in three so I just removed this back again so where we go at the end of the 43 it goes in three like that, one, two, three, and then back three, one, two, three, and then two, in three, one, two, three, and then in four, one, two, three, four. There we go. That's what I screwed up on. Apologies there. Right, anyway, enough of the screw ups and other things like that. What we're going to do now is increase the height of this deck house because it's an awkward one. So, um, what we're going to do is build it to. Uh, we go from the center block of the front. And build it to four. Is it four high? Yeah, four high. So two, three, four. And then it go out to the side. Like so. And then out to the side of the two. And then down the five. And then out to the two. Like that. So that's all four high. And then what you do, they've got this row of 22 here. So build this row of 22 all the way along four high. So row of 22, four high. Try and get this done without screwing it up any more than I already have. Like that. And then what we'll do then from you've got the row of twenty two like that, and then from the last two, from there, you're gonna increase that to five high. So the last two there, five high, and then the rest of the deck house is five high. Well, four high if you count the uh, the section which is raised up there, but it'd be from the last two blocks of the twenty two increased to five high, and then the rest of it, like I say, is five high, just build it to the same height all the way around. And there you go. So the first half's four high, the rest of it will be five high, so that's all fun like that. So I'm going to quickly use world edit for this bit because it's. I know it's a dirty tool, but you know, just to save a little bit of time, so I just build that to four, five high like that. Now, if you want to know want to know how to get world edit, it's a PC only thing, and it's for Java rather than the Windows version, so you're going to be a bit screwed otherwise. So the wind uh, world edit, like I say, for Java only. And basically you just need to find out which version of the game you're running, number, and then go from there. So, say you've got a version like I'm using for 1.12.2, just look for World Edit for 1.12.2 and then follow the instructions and you should be able to get World Edit there. Um, using it is another thing. But I'll just quickly build this deck house to the required height. Like so. So that's like that and then just go all the way down. Five highlights. So, like I said, I'm just using world edits periodically because, or periodically, because it's a bit awkward. And there we go. There's that bit. And then the rest of it down the side is all four high. As <coughs> I say, world edit is a lifesaver in terms of building big things because big things is a pain in the ass. I just build the rest of it like so. And there we go. So there's, <coughs> there's our deck house done like that. And it don't look too bad. So what we're going to do now is to add the main, the rest of the, well, add the deck. There's going to be two two colours again. So it's going to be grey and wood deck. What we'll do, where the, where the, the deck house rises by the extra block, this point here, we're just going to add the wood blocks all the way across. Like so. So from this line all the way back will be wood for the top of the five high section. And then for the four high section, it's all going to be grey. So if I get my grey concrete, wherever it is, I'll leave it there. Just get our grey concrete and build that underneath. Like so. So the, so the five high section is wood, the four high section is grey. So, it, so it's half grey, half wood. So the front half, fill that all in with grey. The back half, fill that all in with wood. And I shall do a quick world edity thing of that. So just use the fill tool. So fill. 251 uh, 7 by 200 or 299 and that fills that front half in like that there we go and then do the same with the rest of it just fill it all in with the wood so fill wood by 200 that fills in the rest of it like so these are all well edit tools as well so you should all be good with that um, and I think I've have I done a boo boo I've done a slight, done a slight boo boo, but it's not a big deal because 
like I said, when, when we add the deck house for the funnel on, this is going to be a big deal because it's going to be where the, the transition is from the red, from the black, uh, from the grey to the wood is going to be stairs. So the, on this line here, it should be stairs. So I might just replace those with stairs for the minute. So we just do the outside three for the minute because the deck house I think is going to be slightly wider than that anyway. So I'll just do three each side like that, just replace with stairs. But I think the deck house is going to be up to one block wider than that. So. We'll see, but that is the deck house done like that, and it, it don't look too bad. Nothing special, but it will do. Um, so what we're going to do now is add some stairs. There's going to be four sets of stairs on this deck house. Two at the front, which will be where the row of two goes out like so. So we'll just remove the top block there like that, and then build stairs going down forward, down to deck level, like so, like that. Just got a little, deck, a little staircase there, and add the banisters two up. Two up, two up like that. So it's stairs there, and then the same the other side. So remove that and put the stairs going down like that. Plus your supports, and then two up, two up, two up like that. There's your stairs there, and then do the same on the back end where the rows of three going. This is where I screwed up earlier. The rows of three going in like this. You want sets of two stairs or two, two wide stairs. So remove the top two blocks and build the stairs two wide like that. And then add the bits like that, and then two up, two up, two up like that. And then the same on the other side. So remove the top blocks, add the stairs. Like so. And then two up, two up, two up like that. And there we go, there's our stairs added there. Nah, nah, looks right that. Right, next job we want to do is to add the doors and windows. If you look on the prototype, we can just see. We've got windows which are two blocks high in that in the main section, and the little section at the front there'll be just single windows. So if we do the single windows first and get my black glass again, because they're quite quite duty, they do they look quite good. So the front half, the lower lower section deck house, we just add single windows along, which are I think they're about three blocks apart. Yeah, three block gaps. So under the grey section, just add windows three blocks high. All the way along, basically all the way up to where the row of two is there, like so. So it windows there like that. And they don't look too bad. Just do the same on the other side quickly. Add single windows every fourth block effectively. There we go. So that's that section there. Um and then the rest of it we shall add two block high windows. So we just go from the front just behind the row of two here. So the front front part of the five high section we just add a window there. And then we'll add a pair of doors. And then, how did I space these ones? These are these are all two block gaps, so two block gap between each window. And how many doors are that? So that's one, two, three, four, five windows plus a door. So that's one, two, three, four, five windows, and then a pair of doors. And then another set of windows. That's one, two, three. Four. That's four windows. And basically, just go all the way along. That's just four, five windows, and then we can just add single windows like so. Is there a pair of doors at the end? We put a single door. Or actually, we can put a double door. Can we put a double door here at the end, like so? Because you got the uh, where the deck rises. And uh, yeah, there we go. And also now, because we've got the deck house in place at the sides here, we can actually add the stairs. Like so, for when you go along the deck, you actually walk up the stairs. Blip, blip. There we go. Yeah, don't look too bad. So just quickly do the other side as well. Um, what was I doing? Oh yeah, windows. So put windows like so, and then doors and things. You can all jump cut this if you want to. You don't have to listen to me waffle on. I'm a very boring person. One, two, three, four, five, and a pair of doors, and then. I actually don't need to count the ones. Three, four, five, and then a single window. Is there only one single window? No, and then a pair of doors. At the end, like that. And there we go. <coughs> There's that deck house done. On the back of the deck house, uh, let me look, let me look, let me look. On the prototype, I can't remember how I laid this out. I think it is. Oh, literally a pair of doors and then some windows. I think the windows are three blocks high, two blocks high. They are two blocks high and three blocks long. So if we just go back 
to where we were working and where we're blah, 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 working from that. Um, so from the ends, I'm going to put on the back wall here. I'm going to put on the ends, I put a pair of doors in here, uh, like so, and then I put glass across the top like that, and then do the same on the other side. So a pair of doors again, and then glass across the top like that, and then on the back wall itself, we just build a or we'll cut a hole three by three or three by two sort of thing, three wide, two blocks high, three wide, two blocks high, there you go, there's your bank window like that, and that don't look too bad, do it, and it, it, it looks right, not brilliant, not perfect, but it will do, because well, that's really what I'm going to do, for now, um, there we go, so that's that section done there, so what I'm going to do, I'm going to do another jump cut while I work out what to do next, and then we can move on, so, um, yeah, back in a moment. Okay, back again. So what we're going to do now is to work on the next deck house, which will support the ship's wheelhouse and bridge wing. So we'll go to the front wall of the superstructure here, and go to the centre block on the front. And on the centre block of the wood, we're going to count back to the sixth block back. So uh, one, on. one, two, three, four, five, six, and add a wood block, um, a red block there to mark the centre. So it's six blocks back. Is it six blocks. Oh, whatever. Six blocks back. Then we're going to build this wall 13 wide. So that is uh, six other sides. So one, two, three, four, five, six that way. One, two, three, four, five, six that way. And then we want to add two out, two, and then two. Two and two like that. And then back two. One, two. And then back 18. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, like that. And then 3, 1, 2, 3. So this all, this all goes along the edge like that. So it's 18, then 3. Um, and then 2, 1, 2. And then in 2, 1, 2. And then in 5, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. And then a centre block like that to mark this centre like so. So I just quickly do the other side. So at the end of the 13, you want 2, and 2, and back 2, and then back... Uh, 18, so 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, and then 3, 1, 2, 3, um, and then 2, 1, 2, into 1, 2, and then 5, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and there we go, that all marks up, lines up with the centre mark like so, and that's our, our deck house laid out, <coughs> like so. And then for the front wall and the bridge wings, the, the front wall will increase to four high. So just the front for the minute, increase that to four high. So just increase this to four high like so. Like that. And then behind that, we're going to build the bridge wings. So behind that, we're going to, from the top line, we want to go out... So from the behind the from behind the front wall on the top block, we're going to build out four. One, two, three, four. Four again. One, two, three, four. And then three. One, two, three. Three again. One, two, three. And then two. One, two. Um, and then back two. One, two. And then in eight. So one, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And then down two to connect to the deck house foundation below. <laughs> Do the same on the other side. So from behind the front wall. Build out two rows of four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Th two rows of three. One, two, three. One, two, three. And then two. One, two. Back two. One, two. And then in eight. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Down two, like so. And there's your bridge wings out, like so. And then the gap between the front wall and the bridge wing pillar there is when it increased to three high. So this, this wall inside here, build that to three high. Like so. Same with the front half, uh, the other half, the other side, whatever. Build that to three high as well. Like that. And then the rest of the walls behind the pillar, all the way around the back, build that to four high. So I shall do one side and I shall use the dirty world edit tool to do the rest. So let's build it four high. Like so. There we go. There's one side done like that. I should quickly copy that to the other side. So quickly copy from there to over there. 
and then just fill that in quickly. So we just do uh, copy, flip to the right, and then paste. And there we go. There's both sides done, and it should look <coughs> something like that. And then what you want to do is just add the deck. So go for the inside of the bridge. We can just add the deck from here all the way to the back wall. And what I'll do, I just use the fill tool again to fill all that in. And that should be done pretty quick. There we go. That's the deck all filled in there. And uh, it don't look too bad. It's, it's quite a neat little deck house, that one. Um, for the front wall of the deck house, we're going to just add four windows. So I'll put... Uh, how, how spaced out are these ones? I think these are sort of... Pair on each side. So put a pair on each side. Um, so put window, window, and then... window windows. So you've got two windows either side of the centre block like that so there's your front wall windows done like that. And now what we want to do now for the for the for, for the ship's wheelhouse we're going to build a wall around the uh, build a wall around the bridge wings uh, to the back of the bridge wings so we just build a wall across the front like so and then around the sides to the back of the bridge wings where they reattach to the deck like so and then I'm just trying to work out. I'm trying to work out how I done this. So it's front. Add a wall around bridge wings plus five on the side. So one, two, three, four, five there like that on the side. And then we do the same the other side. So wall around bridge wing like so, and then down the back, and then one, two, three, four, five like that. And there we go. There's our little thingy. What's it done like that? Next job is to add the, the the ship's wheelhouse itself. So from the centre block we'll add a pillar two blocks high like that. And then both sides we'll add a window and a window, a window and a window like that. So you've got four windows across the front plus the centre block pillar. And then you add a pillar between the two other windows. Two side windows and then a pillar on each side. Like so. And there we go, there's our front windows done. And then the deck house itself is literally just a, a rectangle. So from the back of the pillars, uh, the side pillars, we want to build 13 back. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. Same the other side. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. And across the back. Like so. So literally, like I say, it's just a, a rectangle. And then increase that to 4 high all the way around. Four high like so, and then across the top of the windows. Now, if you like me, then you, you'll add an overhang, but I don't think this ship really requires it. Sometimes when I build ships, I add an overhang across the front like that to give the ship a bit more of a sort of a, a sun visor sort of thing. But this ship doesn't really require that, so I'll leave that off. But the rest of it just increase the four high like so. And then across the back as well, four high. Like so. And then for the windows and doors, we'll add a single window on the side, just behind the front pillar. And then we'll put a pair of doors, without doing too much damage. Like so. And looking at the prototype while I'm doing this, and then what we'll do, we'll add, uh, I think, is it three windows or four windows? That's three windows, and it? We'll add one, two, three, like that. Three win I'll have four windows for it. There's a gap for four windows. We'll put four windows. There we go. Four windows. Probably looks a few too many, but never mind. So we'll just do the same on the other side. Put the window there. There's a pair of doors. And then we'll do our windows. And there we go. There's our deck house done. And then just add the roof, which is literally just. Is it grey or is it white? Is it, what colour is the roof? Oh, the roof is white. Okay, so I forgot that. The roof is white. Okay, so don't bother filling it with wood. Just add white. Like so. So what I'll do, I shall use the fill tool for this one. Dirty well did it again. So fill quartz by 200. And that fills the roof in. There you go. There's the deck house roof added there. Marvellous. Now we'll just move on to one more deck house, which will be the funnel deck house. 
Um, let me just scratch my old noggin in a minute. Eh, that's better. Right. Now for next deck house, we want to go down to the second grey. So we've got the first grey there, go to the second grey on the second deck house. And on the grey, we want to go to the eleventh block back. So from the centre, go eleven blocks back. So two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven blocks back. And then add the centre block there. That's right. I'm just trying to work out if it's right or not. I think it's okay. So eleven blocks back for this deck house. And then the front wall is going to be 13 wide, so that's 6 again, either side. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. I think that might be a bit too wide. I'm going to double check that one, because I want to make sure I get this right. Okay, you know what I'm like, I screw everything up. So, uh, 13. Okay, from that one to this one. Yes, yeah, 13, okay, so it's 6 out of the side. So if this goes wrong, just blame me. So it's 13 down, so it's 13 wide either side. And then 2 on each side, so 13 and then plus the 2 there. And the 2 there. And then the sides are 16. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. There we go. So the last two blocks basically go in there like that so it's 16 so I'll just do the same on the other side 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16 like that and there we go so it's 16 and then uh, 2 at the end so 2 like that and there we go and then just build across the back like so and uh, I don't look too bad like that and then just what you, what you want to do is just increase that to uh, four high all the way around. So let's go from the front. Actually, let's go two, three, four high. Go that four high all the way around. There will be three high when you get to the back end because, of course, the deck rises, but the deck house does not. But we will add a little bit of trim just to sort that one out. I don't think there's any details to add to this one either. There's no windows or doors. It's not like I can see it anyway. And we'll go over and check it in a second. There we go. That's our deck house added there. I just quickly check to see if there's any. Any doors or windows? No, no, nothing, nothing to add there. There will be a. F the only thing that gets attached to this thing is a funnel and a mast, but that's for another day. So on the back of the deck house, before we move on, is the last, uh, the last sort of three blocks. So the last two blocks really, uh, just add an extra wall around like so. So detail like that. It's basically just adds a little bit of trim. And then for the rest of the deck house, we'll just use the grey um, grey roof. So I just add the grey roof going all the way back. Like so. So I just stand on this block here and use the fill tool again. And there we go. There's our roof added. And that's that deck house done. Like I said, you've got a little bit of trim at the back there just to make the deck house a little bit taller, but it, it doesn't affect the deck roof itself. Um, but that is that little job done down there. And yeah, don't look too bad. Now, a little bit of a fun job to do here, this is something that will probably annoy a lot of people, but not me, is to add a little bit of brown trim to the top of the bridge wings and some of the other details. Um, not details, but um, pillars and things. So if we get uh, dark oak slabs, and what we're going to do is on the top of the bridge wings, from the side of the deck house, from the side of the wheelhouse, just add brown slabs on the top of the bridge wings, all the way in again, and then down the line of five like that like so and then with end rods uh, these are what I use end rods we should use those to put pillars, uh, banisters or not banisters but uh, handrails so put a, uh, end rod and then a, a block gap between each like that so put an end rod sort of every other block up to the centre like that and then just add the slabs 
across the top like that. That looks quite good. This is what we've done on the prototype. And uh, just adds a bit of detail like that. I was going to save this to the next part, but this actually looks quite good, so I thought I'd keep it. So there's the, uh, the little bit of trim done there. I'll just quickly do the other side. That and then add our end rods every other block. Oh, missed one. And then just carry on with the handrails around to the other side. This makes it a bit more elegant. These are a bit chunkier than what I would use on my other ships, but as this is sort of a special ship, I'll carry it on like that. Um, the end pillar here, where there's a block here, you can actually replace that with the st with court stairs. Um, and the court stairs just there. So where the, the block changes there, you can actually put some court stairs in like that to give it sort of the curve look. I do the same the other side, like so. <coughs> and don't look too bad. Yeah, looks alright. Now a little bit of detail underneath the bridge wings. We're going to attach the bridge wings down to the deck below, on the on the on the deck here, like so. So from this corner block here, we just add a deck, a little little pillar going up to the bridge wing, and then another one. Just there, like that. Like so. so, you've got two pillars, like so. You can't really see them from any angle, really, but you've got two pillars attaching the bridge wing down to the next deck below. And they did the same <coughs> on the other side, the two pillars, like so, like that. And then on this uh, deck itself, we'll add the brown trim again. So, from the center, we'll add the brown trim going around, like so. <coughs> between the pillars and then up to the side like so. Do the same the other side. There we go. Like that. And then uh, this section here underneath the bridge wings as well. I think there may be some doors or windows to add. I think what we can do let me actually get my windows back again because I threw them away and I didn't want to do that. Um, windows and doors. We'll put a couple of windows underneath the bridge wings like so and then put a pair of doors. Like that and then maybe another window and that's really all you need on this section. So a window and a window, a pair of doors and a window. That just literally covers off this area. So just do the same under here. Put a window and then a pair of doors and then a window there and there we go that covers off that side and there we go that's that little job done there same again next deck below I'll put the brown trim across the front of the uh, front bottom deck uh, bottom of the superstructure or bottom deck of the superstructure like so and there we go that doesn't look too bad it looks a bit odd from some angles, but there we go. Alright, one more, no, I, I, another job to do today is to add, uh, go down to underneath, not the, not the, not the, got the bridge wing deck house, or well, the bridge wings there, and you've got the deck below that, and then the deck below that, which is this open area. What we're going to do is from the single row of pillar here, what we're going to do, we're going to add three back on the deck here, so one, two, three, like that. And then we want 11. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. And then 16. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, like that. And then we'll add a curve a curve block in here for the uh, the, the court stairs again for the, uh, the curve detail. So just a curve block in there like that. So it's sort of like on the deck below. And yep, that's fine. That's, that's how that should be. So just do the same on the other side quickly. So from that in there, we add three, one, two, three, and then eleven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, and then sixteen. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. And then the curve block in there like that. There we go. And then as before, what we did previously, we just add. The brown trim, we just look at the prototype. The brown trim from the stair block, we just add the brown trim along this side. Like so, all the way down the row of 16. Oh, like that. And then like on the prototype, 
at the end we'll add a stair block like so and then we'll add pillars every other block all the way down the side of the deck now this is quite a neat little thing here we look at the prototype make sure I'm doing it right yep so all the way along the side actually there's lots of lifeboats attached on that no, that's fine so just add the, p the pillars every other block all the way down the side oop missed one so go as far as where the deck rises and then we'll go to that point and add the the, 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 the handrails along the side we'll just add these all in first so you've got the handrail going all the way across the top of the pillars like so leave a gap like that and what you want to do you want to sort of raise it up so we go blonk and then one up it's all like that so I'll make them stare up like that stairs these up and then <laughs> we can add pillars again so pillar and then pillar pillar all the way along so just as long as you just build them up to a point where they sort of attach like that and then like I said we just build pillars again every other block Like so, and then all the way up to the uh, the stairs in the middle at the back. So let's quickly do this. Oop, this one. Bit time consuming. I do apologise. I've taken so long with this build, but it it just needed to be done sort of properly. I know some people accuse me of speeding through things, but sometimes I can't be bothered with it. And there we go. There's you can improv a little bit here if you want to, and put an extra pillar there or a block or something just to make it so it attaches to something and then we just do the same on the other side but on the uh, this side is a bit more tricky because you've got the stairs here the stairs are off center so just sort of try and do what you can with that so actually there will be a block there won't there block there and then pillars be offset a bit more so pillar 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 I think isn't it yep so basically the same design what the hell was that I don't know Let's carry on with the pillars all the way around to the other side what do I do I just go to the pillars up to the raised section for a minute get these all out of the way there we go so that's that little section done there just do the back end as well I'll go from the front end of it because it's a bit confusing when I get to there um, so from the uh, curve in here just add that trim again like that and then add the stairs there there and then the trim again not actually I better add the pillars first because that's what I normally do pillar 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 very time consuming and a bit boring I'm getting bored already but I just add the trim again. Like I said, I would normally do this in the last video, but I thought I want to get this out of the way because it looks quite neat. And then the last part would just be sort of just adding the smaller details like the masts, cranes, and things, the funnel, lifeboats, propellers, rudder, and all things like that. And then when we get to the end here, just add the stair, uh, the, the trim going up like that. There we go. There we go there we go there's our trim added and it don't look too bad there will be more going on um, around the, the the deck house at the back there but that'll be once we get the lifeboats in place because um, I don't want to build something and have to remove it again but that is what we have so far today and it doesn't look too bad got all the deck houses in place and yeah so like I say part three when we get back to it just be filling out the details so it'll be the folks details 
Masts, funnel, rudder, propellers, lifeboats. And anything else I can think of, so she's come on come along quite good. I do apologise it's taken so long, but you know, things happen. Colds, flus, heat and me rambling on, but there we go. And also the yellow stripe. Must forget mustn't forget the yellow stripe. Um yeah. But we'll see. So that's it for today. Like I say, part three will be all that, and then we'll move on from there. So this is Rich signing off, logging off, disappearing, and I shall return in part three. So uh, bye for now.